Semi-Slav Defense, Antimarin Gambit, 5, H66.BXF6QXF6. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. It was an incredible middle game by both players. White outmaneuvered Black in the end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The move d5 establishes control over the e4 square, frees up the light squared bishop, and builds a presence in the center. A wing pawn is available in the queen's gambit to attack the center and divert black's attention away from the e4 square. The d5 pawn is supported by c6 in the Slav defense. The d4 pawn is safeguarded and under control thanks to nf3. nf6 controls the e4 square, advances the knight toward the center, and strengthens the d5 pawn. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts to fight for the e4 square. The d5 pawn is supported by e6 and the bishop on the dark squares can advance. bg5 ignores the attack on the c4 pawn and develops the bishop, pinning the knight on f6. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Recaptures. This defends the attacked pawn. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is the last book move. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. That's good. This exchange is fair. That's good. Backs off. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is excellent. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to link together rooks. It is incorrect. That's a decent move. That's good. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. It's alright. That's good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. That's good. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is quite good. Backs off. That's good. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is quite good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This exchange is fair. That's good. From a prior move, recaptures. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This buys time by putting a rook in danger and getting it to flee. It is quite good. The rook is now in a safe position. That's good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This ships the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. 
A powerful play. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. Among the best actions. It is quite good. By doing this, the chance to double rooks on a single file is lost. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to pose a pun winning threat. It is incorrect. By doing this, the chance to double rook on a single file is lost. It is incorrect. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. By elevating it to the 7th rank, this poses a threat of activating a rook. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. A wise decision. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. It's alright. That's good. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. This misses the chance to provide an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. Although white lost their edge, the game is still almost evenly matched. It is incorrect. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. This exchange is fair. White is equal at this point in the end game. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. It is quite good. This enables the adversary to kick a rook. It is incorrect. This threatens to kick a rook. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to kick a rook. It is a mistake. Very precise. It is best. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. It is ideal. Although white had had the upper hand, the game is now almost even. It is incorrect. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. That's good. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a bishop winning threat. It is incorrect. This wastes a chance to protect a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. This protects a bishop who was being attacked and lacked defense. It is ideal. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. Although the score was nearly equal, white now has the upper hand. It is incorrect. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. The potential for an x-ray attack through two pieces exists here. It is ideal. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. This prevents the opponent from being able to create an x-ray attack through two pieces. It is best. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. This enables the adversary to make a passed pawn. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is best. 
This pins the opposing side's bishop to the king, rendering it immobile. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. Very precise. It is best. The pawn is now suitably protected. It is ideal. Thus, a bishop is attached to the king. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This defends the pawn that was attacked. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. A passed pawn can attempt to advance while being defended by a rook placed behind it. It is quite good. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. It is ideal. The checking bishop is moved away in this move. It's compelled. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is incorrect. This wins a pawn. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. This avoids the rook's check. That's good. This raises the possibility of an eventual checkmate. It is incorrect. This disregards an improved method for getting a bishop to safety. It is incorrect. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. This allows a forced checkmate. This threatens to win material. It is a mistake. With the right follow-up, this will lead to checkmate. This prevents the opponent from being able to win material. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. It was an incredible middle game by both players. White outmaneuvered black in the end game. This evades the check from the bishop. It is forced. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. It was an incredible middle game by both players. White outmaneuvered black in the end game. 